So we're approaching uh, the core of Lahaina. This is where, so the fire came from the hillsides up to the right of us and came down into the heart of historic Lahaina, the heart of the historic uh, uh, residences of Hawaiian royalty, the heart of the original uh, tourism trade and international trade, um, uh, where whalers put in, where sandalwood was exported, all that stuff, and unfortunately went right down the gullet of this historic town. So right now as we turn left, We'll see that much of the infrastructure is still destroyed. This is January 2024. So we have an emergency cell tower there for communication. Um, and a little bit of optimistic rainbow there off to the side as we get through this little rain cloud. And so as we pull in, you can see um, the, the huge swath of damage right here through the core of the Haina town. So there's a little bit of, of building going on here. These are areas that were already prepped um, right here to the right that we see some some new building going in but most of the area is untouched so most of the areas we go in you're gonna see um, our cordons and so the public is not allowed into uh, Lahaina right now uh, you have to have a residency permit and you can only go briefly in um, we're just getting ready for debris removal um, which has been a problematic thing. And so this immediate core right here, as we come, these shops were spared. And so with all disasters, we have this, this bit of an irony of, of some uh, areas avoiding the impacts, other areas being hit. So, so ironically, this little um, shopping uh, complex right here, as we turn right, uh, survived. So these stores are here, which is, you know, good for the community. There's, there's some places to buy food, et cetera. But, the residences, the the historic um, waterfront, uh, the harbor where our whale research boat usually goes out of, all of that is destroyed. And so what's gone in now are these uh, barriers uh, to the right and left. Um, uh, one, so that people don't go in, and two, so that uh, it, there's a bit of a, a shielding from the, the public. So as we, we're continuing this way, we're continuing north here towards the, the, the tip of the, the west tip of the island. Um, we are going through, so this is Lahaina proper. And as we continue to go, uh, there's uh, Kanapali and, and these other uh, resort areas just north of us, which were basically unimpacted. And so a lot of the tourists now, this tourist centric economy, everybody is, uh, or the economy is built around you know, people coming in for vacation. And so, so this area has been screened. Um, one, to, to give people some, well, for a bunch of reasons, um, but, but first and foremost, to sort of prevent gawkers from gawking and stopping on the side of the road and taking photos and all that kind of stuff. Um, there's very little inter 